match after we got completely hosed by Burn having sideboard miracle draws. Uh, we can keep this. We have an emergency turn to... And we have control. Uh, of course we have control. Oh no, we might have a Niv match here. Um, you could have a free drop. Actually, we can play this throughout. Yep. Yeah. Alright, let's see what he does. The Celsius, yep. Yeah. So this is um, the uh, meta build of Niv that's floating around. Which will probably prove to be superior to us because uh, we're playing a bit more of a jank off the cuff version. Yep, expressive iteration. And their main board, a Mordigo, is going to remove our Nivs, which will probably cripple us well before. Apologies if I'm not enthusiastic, but I pretty much think that we have uh, probably lost now. Alright, we just exile this. Alright, if we play this, we can go green, white, and we can hold up. Green, white, red, white, yep. Green, white. They'll live on their turn, then we can uh, just to strike it, then we'll grab Valky. Unless. Yep. There's their ring to light. Right, so they've stolen our Niv, so I wonder if maybe we could steal their Niv. Nope, they're going for the Tibble play. They know the line. Alright, they get a land and a thing. Arboring to light, we could grab dirt, or we could. I think we have to do Arboring to light here and do a Valky play too. Two are gonna have to do a Valky play. So, 
Nope, it does. We're just gonna have to keep going up with our Valky too. All right, we got another bring to light. That can help us out. We just gotta put pressure on there. Tibbles. Which abrupt decay did we hit? Was this ours or theirs? Yeah, it had to be ours. One, two, one, two, three, four. If we could, um get a land into their graveyard we could uh, we could clothis land cram sessions introduction to annihilation remove the tibbles Oh yeah, we're getting life with the Clothis. So even a Tybalt ultimate here is really not doing anything. Yushan, Impactful Earth. Do we kill that or do we exile that? They get carrioted, so we can't really get through with what we've got right now. Hmm. So if we take this, we can land. We set ourselves up for the next one, two, three, four. Could just keep doing shit with this. You know what? Let's keep stealing their stuff, I think. It's the best action. So we have a land drop, we have a bring to light for later. I mean exiling graveyards doesn't do anything because there's nothing to exile. So let's let's take the Yishan here. Hold on, if we cram session. There's introduction to annihilation, which is one, two, one, two, three, four. We're still too short to do that. So I think, do we just fish for the top of their deck? We could just keep fishing here. You know what? No, I think we need to exile the Yishan. We need to take the Yishan. No, not the bring to light. And then we need to cast Ishan. Oh, let us get some land. Wait, where's our basic planes? Which is fine because we'll go down on this. We can play. Yeah. It's a cram session here. Let's grab introduction to annihilation. Pass the turn. We can't get in from there, so we gotta pass. They got a Niv reborn and an Edgar. Ugh. They hit my Edgar. That is frustrating. However, whatever they exile, I will take with Tybalt to cast later. Yep, 
What do you reveal with your... Okay, revealed, Omnath, bring to light. Oh, they get bring to light, that's it. So they still have Omnath when they need it. They could have counter magic for the... Uh, No, they have Omnath. Oh no, they have Edgar. Which is my Edgar. So, if I exile this Niv, and then attack out. I can exile the Niv for later. Yeah, that's the best option here. Right, let's exile Niv for later. Let's play this land tap. We can then Justice Strike Edgar. One, two, three, four, five. You know what? I think we go on the attack here. Let's attack him directly. See how he blocks. This is great because now Edgar will transform under my graveyard because he dies under my control. Okay, now we'll introduction to annihilation this. Right there, Edgar is gone. Right. Man, Edgar is, keeps going up in my estimations. All right, they play the land, which means they must have something to deal with. A little board state. Probably Omnath. Well, they probably should have played Omnath first, then drop the land to gain four life. To light for five, probably finding a Niv. Uh huh. Let's see what this reveals Dreadball, Coligan's Command, Vanishing Verse. Alright, so we Dreadball's the Tybalt, which is fine. Yes, we are going to win this one on more of an attrition based game. My friend, so we exile your bring to light here. Wait, what happened to Edgar? What happened to the oh, we Coligan's command did. Oh, I see, I see, that makes more sense. So we just to strike this one two one two three four five yeah we can do that totally fine so let's just to strike this red white then let's cast the stolen live it. some cram sessions, we'll get our Coligan's Command and our Bring to Light. Sweet. Uh, it can't do anything on the attack so we can just sit back. Alright. Omnath. I know, just Bring to Light again. 
Do they run a full play of four of visits? Yes, they do. Tulsamir, Shadow's Verdict, Nahiri. They could Nahiri. Nahiri would allow them to get rid of Clophis. Oh no, just Tulsamir. Gain free life. Give me a blocker. I believe he's dead here. Yes, he is indeed. So we do this, put him down to seven. We will return the Niv Mizzet to your hand. Blue, black. We'll then hit you with your own Niv Mizzet, put you down to one. And then we will call against command. Uh, deal. Oh no, they know it's coming, so they conceded. Um, this is awkward. So I'm thinking we bring in Oz and uh, maybe another calling ritual, and we go down the vanishing verses because they are completely useless in this matchup. Yes, that was fun. So. We won by Valkying, basically. I wonder if them hitting Valky would have been a better choice. Obviously, the issue. Yeah. Oh. Well, we'll see. They go first now. The Celestus is an interesting choice. I need to check what that card actually does again. Let's have a look. Everything to this. Is a free amount of mana rock that could that let you loot when day and night transpire. Oh wow, this hand is totally not keepable. Let's mulligan. Guess we can keep this. Um we should get rid of our basic island. That's why we couldn't play the planes from the Yishan. I just realized, duh, that guy had the... Uh... We want to play the Voice of Resurgence definitely on two, so we have to play the Deserted Beast first. Yes. Shock this in and immediately deploy a voice of resurgence. They don't appear to be able to cast their unmoored ego right now. Oh, they got a clothis, cool. So let's play our wandering mind. We'll take a crown session. Hit them down to 17. Big fan of big old cloffy. The expressive erasure ring. And they concede, okay. Interesting. I'm guessing they got screwed on lands. It happens, as we say. Um, do I take that that our learn package beat out a NIF package? Uh, no, I don't think. I think literally uh, they played in game one particularly a little bit poorly they put a lot of emphasis on the Valky they knew that we could Valky yeah well it was a weird setup really 
If they'd gone for Brink Lights instead of Niv Mizzets, I think that's a better thing to snipe out the deck. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. Move on to round three.